sorry for the wobbling but my sticks were in tire vets off the tractor I couldn't get a solid platform I just want to thank Ian Blackwood from Blackwood Outdoors he sent me the Hick Micro down Hick Micro 4k sorry to try and um, yeah I'm really impressed so far daytime footage is really good as well and um, if you need to buy anything off uh, Blackwood Outdoors I'll leave, it, I'll leave the link in the description below and um, go and check him out. I think you can also get hold of him on Facebook as well. Um, so if you need anything like a Hick Micro 4K or 4K LRF, give him a bell and I'm sure he'll sort you out. Please keep watching to the end because if you stay watching to the end, you'll see a cracky bit of footage. It's footage I've never seen before. So if you get if you can stay to the end and watch the video, that'd be perfect. You won't be disappointed. <laughs> Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Um, out again on the foxes tonight. Um, feel my farms are lambing at the moment, so good chance to get out and see if I can mop a couple of foxes up. And um, that's where I'm off now. So I'm off to I'm off this one farm first. I haven't been there for about a year. Um, there's a bit of confusion with this farm, so but he rang me and asked me to come back and have a look. And um, so that's why I'm going first. So I'm hoping to get one or two off there because I haven't been here for a bit. And then I'll be off to another farm then that I go to quite regularly. It's a very productive um, farm and always produce a lot of foxes. I don't know why, it just does this constant flow of foxes coming through there. So um, that's where I'll be going later on. And um, hopefully we'll get a couple. So I'll bring it back later on in the video. Left the first, even the first farm now. Ed one, um, big dark fox or dog fox, but um, yeah, I only saw the one on our farm, so um, I'm on, on my way to the next farm now and uh, see what I can get there. It's usually, usually a good farm, so we'll see what happens. These foxes always seem to follow the same route. There's a gully that runs down the middle of this field. This field is about 600 yards long, but there's a gully that runs right down the middle of it. And they always seem to follow the same route down the gully. And um, if you stand on a farmer's track, you can guarantee it's about yeah, it was 160, 180 yards to the gully. And, um, but it's a good place to stand and a good place to shoot them.
you see this fox pass the fox that I shot earlier there's a fox like slain by, by that grass but there that's the man you when I shot and uh, this fox walks straight past it now I think he's winded it and um, but it's too late because um, I think he goes back he goes back for a second look but uh, when he turns that's when I shoot him you want to shot earlier I shot another one there now it's fixing Them two up now. One was a dog fox when I shot with a stock fence, and uh, the other one was a vixen. But loads of man generally, she's full of man, doing a massive fever, and she's very thin as well. So, yeah, so you see the well, you see the pictures, but uh, a bit of a mess on that one as well. So, but. I said I'm too picked up anyway and uh, just hang around now see if I get in the ass She came in and sniffed my collar and she went, no, no way too late Here's another one coming down the gully watching a fox it's circling and some newborn lambs up atop the field they're about 170 yards away and um, but the, the, the ewe's a good mother she's fend defending a fox off he's about 30 yards out from us at home and I'm trying to keep an eye on I keep an eye on his fox and um, if he gets too close I'll take a shot
shot the fox bear. That's, but I've never seen that before. I haven't. I've seen a, I've seen a fox walking through a field full of sheep and lambs. I've never seen a fox circling a ewe like that. But um, yeah, I took a shot. It, it it crouched out. It looked like it was gonna bounce, like like leap on the. But I took a shot, so it's down anyway. And um, and I go up and have a look and um, just make sure go see what the fuck what dog it is. See if it's a dog or a vixen. I don't know what it is. So we'll have a quick look. Two very lucky lambs tonight. Very lucky. Yeah, I, I, to be honest, I've never caught a fox doing that on video. I've seen a fox walk through a field where we and lambs, like walking through and trying to walk up to a ewe when she's, like, she's trying to give birth and stuff, but I've never seen that before. And um, yeah, it was a surreal thing to watch. So, but I'll send the video and um, that'll be it for tonight. But um, yeah, so six all together. One from the other farm, five year, and um, one Abbey farmer. I have texted him and told him that um, a fox just swung in the lambs. He didn't even know the lambs were here, so he hasn't started lambing yet, so he didn't even know these two lambs were on the field. So he's over the moon, he is. I'll send him a video later when I get home. And um, but yeah, that's the end of the video, guys. And um, thanks for watching. And um, please like, subscribe as normal. And um, leave a comment in the video, and um, hopefully I'll catch you all in the next one. See you then, guys.